for number one, we have uh, in 2020, Fort Bend County has a, had a population of 822,780, according to a U.S. Census Bureau. The annual rate of population change is 4.5%. If population growth continues at this rate for the next five years, what will the population be for Fort Bend County? So here, your initial, your initial amount will be 822,780. Your uh, rate, it's gonna be 4.5%, but you change it to decimal. The time concerns here will be five years. So we are simply finding what the A is. So simple placing, simple uh, question here. You would put all these uh, numbers into the equation. Okay, so you have the rate, you have the time, you have the initial amount, voila. Just go ahead and put this into the calculator. And that should give you the uh, amount accordingly. Okay. So no curveball, no curveball, no, no uh, difficulty. Just put it into your calculator. Okay, so, so uh, 822,780 times e to the power of 0. 0.0. Oh, um, no, point oh what? Oh, four, five. Point oh, four, five. Oops. Point oh, four, five. Oops, sorry. Point oh, four, five times five. Okay. So let's see what it is. I somehow have a scientific notation. Let me see if I can... Uh, Put it to um, you see if that works. Nope, that doesn't work. Uh, where did I put the uh, I don't know how to put it, but yeah, one point oh three million. Okay. So if you say, uh, if you put it in scientific notation, that's fine. If your calculator gives you the whole thing, that's cool too. Yeah, if your calculator tells you uh, uh, what the, uh, what all the amounts are, what the uh, digits are. Oh, yeah. So like this. One, one, oh, three, oh, three, eight, six. All right. So, um, so either way, I would take it. All right. I would take either scientific notation or the actual number. It doesn't matter. As long as, get, as, long as you get one million. I'm happy. <laughs>